hello guys how are you today I'm gonna tell you how to install automation studio uh, so this is my machine I have installed a virtual machine inside my MacBook so if you have a Windows machine you don't need to worry about anything just open the browser go to the website B and R downloads go to downloads and then couple of seconds and the website will open and then go to downloads here on the right hand corner go to accept all cookies yeah select software and then sorry select software then select automation studio then select the version here I will download automation studio 6 and then you can come down and click on this icon where the download hyperlink is it will open up a new window and then your download has started so I will wait until it's get downloaded and then I will uh, open it up and tell you how to down how to install it into your machine okay so I have downloaded this automation studio 6.1.1.4 and now I'm going to unzip it so just do this extract all and while doing so it will extract all the files into another folder where you can uh, dive it into and run the so software setup so just let so now we have the folder extracted we will double click and go into it install run it and run as administrator and we'll wait until it gets open so see now you have the setup running which will install automation studio 6 into your windows machine now we'll proceed uh, choosing english language and we'll install it give the command to install so now we'll wait and it will ask a few of the things from you like setup will guide you through the installation of automation studio 6 it's, it is recommended it is recommended that you close all other applications before starting setup this will make it possible to update relevant system files without having to reboot your computer so yeah I will go and do the next I accept the license agreements do next next and we can you can also add German language pack if you are if you know how to work in German language but as I do not so I will continue and do install and I will wait until all this finishes up after you have installed the automation studio setup you need to figure out how to get the license for BNR automation studio so simply go on to Google type BNR automation studio licensing and uh, like this license and search go to the website licensing and you will you will get a form to fill so go down a little bit and here you will get a request a free 90 day evaluation license so when you are using an evaluation license some of the features will not be working in the automation studio that but that's fine we are here not for um, other complex stuff but to understand how automation studio basically works so I have already filled up this form for myself and you, once you do that I have read the EULA send request and then you will get a you will get a basic you then you will get a license on your personal or commercial email ID I am using it for educational purposes so just it will be coming on my um, Hormit license key so I have basically copied it and I am going to paste it and click activate so this license key will come on your email id once you fill up the form on the bnr website and once you click on the activate it will come connect with the internet through the server of the bnr and try to uh, check if this license uh, keys are perfect or not and here we go we have 90 days left in evaluation period so our license has been activated so once it's activated you just need to wait a couple of seconds and let the BNR automation studio run for you and in 
and here you can see that the code meter so this is a container connected code meter which runs your which holds your license keys for your BNR automation so now we have the win window now we can see that we have the automation studio 6.1.1.14 now basically you can go here create a new project and enjoy the BNR automation studio 6 uh, stay tuned on this channel as i will be updating other videos as well on bndr automation studio how to program code configure it etc from basics to excellent we will do everything together so hope i you liked it wait for my next video thank you